Hello, I am Dr. Prakash Mahadevappa. I am a general surgeon, a senior consultant in the Department of General Surgery, Columbia Asia Hospital, Whitefield. As I told you earlier, the hernia is basically a defect in the abdominal wall. It is only covered by skin, that's all. It is indirectly, the intestines come out through the hole and they go back. This keeps happening in the initial phases when it is the intestines very freely come out of the abdomen and go back into the abdomen. But however, as the hernia progresses, these contents start protruding in a bigger amount, they get stuck up outside when it is called as incarcerated or irreducible hernia. The contents of this hernia, the intestine and the fat which have herniated outside or come out of the abdominal wall, these get their blood supply compromised because of the tight opening of the hernial defect. This causes the intestines or the fat which has herniated along to suffer from decreased blood supply and the tissues may uh, ultimately die and this is what we call as strangulated inguinal hernia. This is one of the complications of hernia, the most serious complication of a hernia and it is for this reason that these hernias have to be repaired. When a patient has strangulation, the patient has exquisite pain at the site of the hernia and patient will be sick. An emergency surgery to relieve the intestines and to get back the blood supply to the intestine has to be done. So an emergency hernial surgery will have to be done in such patients. Having said this, umbilical hernia is a defect in the navel and these two also can undergo strangulation. Therefore, it is wiser to consult a surgeon if this defect the umbilicus which we call as umbilical hernia needs any surgical correction.